Oh my god, finally on the road again. I have missed it so much and I definitely need to travel more this year. I'm feeling so free and happy and I know that sounds always so corny, I hate it. <laughs> But yeah, it's how it is and the arrival was a bit stressful. Um, the only thing that's a bit annoying is I can show you where the car stands in a bit <laughs> um, and with the two dogs the whole things um, that I have with me it's a bit heavy and all the snow but mm, I don't want to uh, god I forgot the word it's very early I don't want to complain right complain um, so yeah It's beautiful, look at this freaking background and I also thought about uh, changing this airbnb but I think I'm going to stay the thing is that there are some points which is not okay for the price I paid I paid a lot for this little wood house but yeah let me show you where the car stands I cannot zoom with this camera, but the car is there. There's the car. Yeah. <laughs> but look at this, it's so beautiful. Oh my god. Such a calmness. Oh my god, hello sun. Oh, it's so beautiful, really. The snow that glitters. And yesterday I thought this all oh, the snow. Guess that's a bit too loud now. Let's wait. Okay, now I can talk again. So I thought all oh, the snow this somehow brings out my child again because actually I'm this super duper summer person I love the sea I love the, the sun and everything but um, earlier when I was a child and it snowed I always got out and film everything just film with a camera unfortunately I don't have any of these clips anymore but I just love it I don't know, it brings out so much joy and the inner child, yeah. So now we're going to a sea, uh, to a lake, sorry, to a lake with the um, dogs and then to a museum. Very excited for this one. That's what actually the whole trip is about, about this museum.
guys, so welcome in the bathroom. Why am I sitting here? This has just one reason. Here you have floor heating. And the whole, um, whole other room is cold, freezing cold, because there's no heating and the fireplace thing is not working. I don't know what's the problem, but it's just not working, but okay. Okay. Don't mind. Still happy about this floor heating in the bathroom. Better than nothing, right? So, as you can see, today, today, I haven't visited the museum, but tomorrow, for you, in a bit, in a second, in a few seconds. Um, yeah, this is the reason that the change was planned. What am I talking? The plan was changed. And today was the visit to a, um, to a town. I already forgot the name. I will write it here. Or maybe I can have a look at my phone. Just give me one second. How is it called? The town. First, the first stop was Speeds, and the other town in Speeds, um, or just walking with the dogs, and then, oh, I don't know how it's called, me, I think it's Gstad, yeah, um, and looked for some perfumes, maybe you saw it, um, Maybe I blend it in. I don't know yet how I edit the video, but yeah. Then I was in a supermarket and got this cute little thing. You can still see the price, it's still not there. <laughs> but I thought it's such a cute, um, oh, it's so light. I already forgot the words again. Um, some like a nice undenken. Hmm? Yeah. It's loud. Yeah. Then I got Ovo Maltina. That's the first time I tried Ovo Maltina. And it's so freaking delicious. Oh my god. I just love Thing I got, maybe you know this if you're from Switzerland. Oh, I see, maybe this is also from Italy because it says Dolce di di Carneval. Some people spoke um, Italian there, I'm not sure if it was the part where people, people also speak um, Italian, but it looks like this. Oh, and it's so yummy. It's like, I don't know if you know Tuk, but this is sweet. Yeah, very nice. And, um, yeah, ended the day with a very nice whirlpool gang. <laughs> How to say it in English? Um, ended the day. And this was very nice. Needed to go barefoot through the snow, which was very cold. And um, yeah, then in a whirlpool and outside it's so freezing cold with all the snow. And then you go into the whirlpool and oh, everything is just fine. That was um, the reason why I went to this um, Airbnb. Because of the whirlpool and it just looked so nice on the pictures. Maybe I can show it to you. Um, yeah, but a few things are here that are not that nice, so yeah, I 
should only look at the whirlpool, <laughs> but it's okay. It's really okay. Where we have a picture. I saw this and this and this. It's very beautiful and I love to be um, yeah, in the nature and everything, but I don't want to talk about negative stuff right now, but it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, but for this prize, I should, I have expected a little bit more, just a little tiny bit, not much, but a little, <laughs> um, yeah, I end this here now <laughs> and go to bed, um, I still need to make one voiceover for um, a TikTok vlog, I'm filming also some little TikTok vlogs and then I go to sleep yeah excited what tomorrow will bring thank you for watching until now drive away the museum and of course I want to have a walk with the dogs first in a way I had no internet anymore it's a little bit difficult in the Switzerland here with the internet because it's not the European Union and um, yeah now I need to go back for some Wi-Fi and yeah now I need to book Wi-Fi then I need to go with the dogs and I guess then it's too late to go to the museum because it's yeah it's a few hours away not few hours but one hour and 30 minutes so <laughs> yeah but it is how it is now and um, let's book some Internet.
as you have seen it was such a nice castle, so beautiful, it also looked so mystical. And now, home, find something to eat, and I looked at this here, so maybe we're going for a walk with the dogs here tomorrow. sit here. It's finally warm in this Airbnb. The fireplace is working and that's perfect because it was ice cold here. So, hey. Yeah. Um, and as you have seen, no museum today, but definitely, oh, that was the fireplace, definitely tomorrow. Definitely, definitely. Um, yeah, I don't have to say um, much now, I just wanted to give you an update that it's warm in this ARPP now. Um, so yeah, we visited the beautiful castle today and it was so beautiful there, the landscape. I love to just drive around, so, um... Maybe you think oh, you don't do a lot of things right now, but I, I have to say, I have to admit, I just love to, yeah, to just sit in the car and drive. Um, but yeah, four days, four days are way to less time. Next time, need more time again. And yeah, see you tomorrow.
think how could I even survive for 27 years without any accident <laughs> I don't know I had one car accident but it wasn't my fault it was with a bicycle and yeah I'm happy everything is okay let's say it like this but um, I also drove slower than I could the limit was 100 and I drove 80 and yeah then there was a street and a girl with a bicycle the street with, without seeing me I guess but I don't know how you, how you can see me and then I saw it but unfortunately a bit too late I saw that she didn't stop and then right in front of my car but everything is okay with her and um, yeah that was my first car that I got. I got it from my grandma. And uh, yeah, that was a total schaden. I don't know the English word, but I couldn't drive this car anymore. And yeah, that was really hard because I was young, didn't have a lot of money and needed a new car. And of course there's the insurance but if there are people who didn't believe it was their daughter's fault even if the police is saying this it needed some time for the insurance and you also get a tiny tiny bit of money for this car it has such a it had such a huge worth for me, but on the paper, of course, it said something different. And that was the story of my car accident. You're welcome. <laughs>
I need to take a deep breath <laughs> a deep breath in and out oh god oh god oh god I wish I could sit on this chair here but it's full of snow hello okay let's do it like this okay so today was the day finally went to the museum of Haya Giga and that was very inspiring very 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 inspiring um, and <laughs> in German you would say um, it was a kind of so a little pervert I think <laughs> no but um, I don't know how much I can show you because the paintings are crazy very inspiring <laughs> Uh, kind of very, very mystical and he's also not alive anymore and it was so so beautiful there because it was a little like castle and um, yeah there was also like a bar a restaurant which was also crazy you have seen it probably in the vlog in the vlog I needed to film that with my um, iPhone because I didn't know if cameras were allowed um, I think they were allowed but yeah I just let it in the car so yeah then also had a look at Guyer oh and the the most craziest thing ever went also to the to the grave graveyard grave of High Giga and there was so unbelievable I have no words for this it was such a crazy atmosphere there because everything was so quiet this little village was so like the time stands still there and um, it was like um, on, the, on the stone the, the gravestone Grabstein in German it was on it it was his um, so crazy I have to say I took a picture of this because it was it was just beautiful um, and until now I'm not sure if I show it on here I don't know if it's if you, what's the word pietätslos um, so I don't know yet maybe I hear a few opinions if I should do it or not but you can also google that and see a picture of it then and then also went to look a bit at Goye and there was a store this town is famous for the cheese there and went there and bought a little Heidi shirt probably I'm going to make another ASMR video and show you all the stuff I got in Switzerland it's not much but just a few things yeah, a cute Heidi shirt, cheese, and um, normally I don't eat a lot of cheese anymore, but this woman, I wasn't sure which cheese I should take, and this woman had like samples and gave it to me, and oh my god, let me tell you, I never tasted such good cheese that was crazy. The taste was something like a Geschmack Explosion. <laughs> oh, I don't know why my English is like that here. Normally I can speak English, but in this vlog it's, vlog it's a bit weird. <laughs> but yeah, and then the snow was already melting. Um, and now as you can see it's completely snowing. And um, maybe you can it a bit better now um, yeah the thing is that my as I said it was melting it's now it's snowing again and this Riedli it's called Riedli this little cottage house um, also to a wood house <laughs> um, it's on thousand meters very high in the mountains up in the mountains and um, 
couldn't get up. And I have winter tires. I don't know what was the problem. I also have snow chains, but I didn't know if I could bring them on because I was standing like this and I for this um for the snow chains I need to put it on, then drive a bit and close it. And um I couldn't do this because I was like this. <laughs> And that's a horror for me. I'm really not a... I don't have fear of a lot of things. I'm not scared that cool or fast. But I hate standing with a car like this. I just hate it so much. Also in a park house or something like that. And um, then what, what helped was yeah, doing the snow away. Like kicking the snow away. And then I could drive a little bit, then again, could drive a little bit. And my car was like slithering so much, slithering, slippering. It was crazy. And I was so nervous. Oh my god, that was horrible. <laughs> but I did it, finally. I'm up here. And normally there's also a car um, for the salt on the street too, you know, you know, that you can drive there. And he was there behind me but couldn't do anything so that was horrible but now I'm here and tomorrow's the last day and I only need to go down that's good <laughs> um, yeah completely out of my comfort zone really yeah but it's beautiful the snow is so beautiful see it's so nice story of today. That was the story of today. I hope you enjoyed. Tomorrow's the last day. And yeah, I just love to travel again. I missed it so much and all oh, the snow crunch. Love it.
Okay, finally back home. Finally, I already miss being on tour. Doggy Dog is also here, one of the doggy dogs. And I wanted to say so much, but I forgot everything because it was such a long drive. I guess seven or eight hours. Yeah, what were, what were all the things I wanted to say? Can't be that I forgot everything. But yeah, here it also snowed a lot. There's so much snow. It's like Switzerland, and it's rarely here, um, so it's very unusual that you have so much snow here. But I'm happy about the snow, even though I'm more the summer person. I enjoy the silence because I always always have the feeling when it snows that um, it's so quiet outside, and I like that. So yeah, the. The little mini vacation is over. It was too less time and I want to plan a new vacation. <laughs> um, a nice goal would be to travel every month. Um, in March, goes to Ibiza with my mother. Um, that was her Christmas present for me and um, I'm really looking I need to see vitamin C <laughs> um, yeah I really really hope that you like the vlog what do I wanted to say? there was something else but I completely forgot oh, I know what I wanted to say <laughs> I don't know if it's necessary but I tell you you always notice that when you drive away from Germany and come back those highways are horrible in Switzerland I could drive very peacefully everything was nice I had my tempo mod on don't know the English word could drive peacefully and back in Germany everyone wants to go as fast as they can and if you don't drive as fast as they want you to they look so angry to you drive um, next to your car and go like or yeah, I don't know it's horrible, I hate the traffic on German highways yeah but yeah I guess that was everything I wanted to say <sighs> sometimes I don't feel German but I don't I don't feel like I have no idea I just feel like Sofia but not German or anything else I don't know <laughs> Yeah. and yeah, if you enjoyed this vlog leave a like and if you like, a comment <laughs> um, tell me how you find all these impressions and um, let me know your thoughts 